the Irish Naval Service showcasing its fleet to mark its 75th anniversary. The event began at Dunleary Port with a Guard of Honour inspection by Minister for Foreign Affairs Simon Coveney. As the LE Samuel Beckett left the harbour, an artillery gun salute before making its way to join the rest of the naval fleet at Sir John Rogerson's Quay. The Irish Naval Service has been trying to boost its numbers. Many are stepping down from serving, leaving it so short that sometimes it cannot put its ships to sea. But I'm very pleased that the Minister has put in place a commission on the Defence Forces and it's looking at the issues around this. So we can have a naval service that is fit for purpose, that we can have an army that is fit for purpose and we can have an air corps that is fit for purpose with an appropriate joint structure where the air corps and the army and the navy don't sit as silos but as an integrated joint force that meets the priorities of government. Leisha Mulcahy is a new recruit, while David Mulcahy joined in 2012. I kind of thought that I didn't want to start, you know, the typical straight into college after school. I wanted to try something different and, and experience something. So I looked into my options and I have family history in, in the Defence Forces as well, not the Navy, but the Army. I was involved in the, um, the Michaela Bella drug operation um, back in 2014 or 15. Um, that was probably one of the biggest I was involved in, uh, in my career so far. The fleet minus one ship, which will be on patrol, will overnight in port. It will sail on to Cork City on Saturday, again overnighting. Sharon Lynch, RT News.